I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this I'll always show up I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this I'll always show up and make a statement Alright Frankie, engine mounts are your friend What'd you got yourself there? We've had a little failure oh. with the um, Mirage engine mount. Oh. And there's not a lot of choices when it comes to a replacement. You can get an original one. Right. Which is the same old floppy rubber ones. Yep. You can get some solid rubber ones. Right. Or do what we decided to do. And we asked Mad Polly for oh. some mounts. A good Queensland company. Right. And they make a solid insert that goes into your existing mount. Oh, very nice. And the only bad bit is you've got to get the rubber horrible failed ah. bit out of your original original um mount and then shove these on okay we've got them for all four mounts send you a little kit or you can buy them for whichever mount has failed and just replace one at a time it's gotcha a little bit cheaper now frankie your choice is hard to go with a like a hard race one or a, a solid rubber one or polyurethane you've chosen polyurethane yeah yeah well hard race there was none in the country oh and one mount is dearer than the whole kit from poly oh there you go so for a little bit of elbow grease yep and it gets a bit dirty we're going to do the poly ones. Righto. All right, Frankie, let's go into the disassembly side of things. Sweet. So, Frankie, no more blow torches for you. You used to nearly set the shed on fire, but what do you got yourself there? Well, Ooh. it's a bit of a messy job, and you get this. It's got oil inside the um, oh. rubbery mount and a bit of chiseling, and there's a little race in here, which you saw before. And so now we've got our, um, our poly mounts, and look at that. Oh. They just go in there. Just like we knew, Frank. And uh, we're going to bolt them in. Oh my God. Well, first of all, I'd like you to put a bit of gloss black paint onto that uh, housing and we'll make it look like new. Sweet. Okay. Top dead. Well, Frankie, keep an eye for Slippery Sam. What do you got there? Mate, uh, this is what happens when you remove the bush. We didn't remove it because it was a bit of a debacle. Right. But they said there's an inner race. And if you can see here, oh. there's the inner race here. Oh. But the rubber bit is bonded to this. Oh. So we were trying to get the rubber bit out and there was a bit hanging down. So we just bashed it, of course. Yes. Well, know, I think you used the blowtorch on that, didn't you? And, yeah, we did, but um, the, the second one I did for the land, so I just used the hole saw and cut the oh, rubber God. bush out and then grabbed hold of that and just right. whacked it out. It's full of oil, so it's super messy. Get it on your face and that's yep. all good for you. Right. But then we shoved these, uh, these bushes in, so knock that out. You don't need it. Right. And here's your bush here, and that one should just uh, slide on there. Oh, and then we're, we're ready to... Um, Pop There's it on here. Right in there. You don't get a Lancer no. engine mount for your Mirage or the other way around because we tried that and it doesn't work. No. All right, and that, that's a bit elliptical, that bush there, Frank. You've got to line him up to where the bolt holds. Ooh. Yeah, it is. So yeah. hopefully we've got it in the right spot. Probably not, so we won't film that bit either because no. we'll muck it up and swear and curse. There's one down there. We might grab that one out and we'll, we'll do it as well. I reckon hang the motor on the top of that one so it doesn't flop onto the ground. And then we can do the bottom one. Is there another one after that as well? There is. There's one over here and one under the battery. So we've got a little bit of work to do. We do. All right, Frankie. I'm going to keep an eye out for red bellies and eastern browns. Let's get stuck into it. So, Frankie, it's always a good day when you're playing with fire, particularly next to my uh, my race car. So that's good fun. I've got a good track record, haven't I? Oh. We need to heat this thing up a bit. I've already done this one. Right. So you melt all the glue that's holding the, um, yep. the little thing. And grab your channel locks. Oh, you fuck. grab this. this oh, jeez. Don't burn yourself. No. Grab that. Pull that out. Oh. A little bit smoky. Yeah. Now we need to melt on the outside. Right. Hopefully that'll go just as smoothly. Okay. Probably should be wearing gloves. And eye protection. Yeah. yeah. Safety third all the time. Between the Oh, <laughs> well, so Frankie, you've decided to put some gloves on. Yeah, yeah, just to hold this little bit. Yeah. Hopefully this comes out easy, but oh, geez. You know, uh, you know us. Looks like one of Mrs. Fred's cakes. It never works out that way, does no, it? No, you don't want that. Oh God, here we go. Now, Frankie, any uh, any Star Wars references today? Definitely not from me. Right. Oh, I don't go there. Okay. No. Oh, that looks a bit hmm. Mandalorian, doesn't it? Oh, jeez. Maybe we'll try a little bit wide on the channel locks. Right, eh? Maybe not that wide. Oh. There we go. Well, Frankie, you nearly burned the garage down, but what have you got there? Oh. Yeah, yeah it wasn't the neatest bit we did, but um, there's still a little bit of tacky stuff, and we've filed right. a bit, and 
Yeah. But the, the bush goes in. Okay. So uh, we might just uh, go with that. Ooh. Good enough for, for us. Very nice, Frankie. And, uh, solidify that mount. Very nice. And then we'll go for a drive once all these are fitted. We'll tell Mr. Mad Polly what they feel like. Exactly. Oh, stop, Dad. Fantastic. So, Frankie, we're getting ready to put this uh, lower engine mount in. Yep. And uh, Mitsubishi, I think, have designed razor blades on all sharp edges so you end up with cut forearms. Frankie, yeah, you definitely do. I've got in these small little hands, which neither of us have. No. Um, one thing we notice is this. Um, Mm. Bolt is a fair bit smaller, but it's the same size as the, um, the oh, one yeah. that came out. Mm. So I'm guessing all the load is rust resting on the um, the bush. Yep. And you got to jam it in there and get this back bugger in first. So, Frankie, we have to go down in there. Yes. It was fun getting it out, and I'm sure it's going to be fun it's getting it out. It's going to be start, even more so. fun. Yep. All right, let's get stuck into it. All right, film that bit. Well, Frankie, what else would you rather be doing on a Sunday? That one's in. It is. This one's oh. a little bit of work. A little bit of work. Uh, not Hammer. much fun. Hammer, screwdriver, a bit of sweat, perspiration, a bit of blood, Frankie. A couple of swear words. Yes, well, we... We got there. Yep, yeah, well, I was whispering prayers to Yoda and... Ooh, don't say that. No, maybe Star of the Jedi. Oh, Frankie, you having fun yet? Who knew you could have so much fun with such a shitty little car? Oh, no, no, no. Oh, they call them Mitsubishis, Frankie, not what no. you just said. No. But uh, that's in, Frankie. You bet. Oh, so you actually have to take the back... <laughs> A big bloody bash plate off the front of it oh, and drop it. If, uh, if you're doing this yourself, just take the um, the support off, take yeah. both of them off at the same time. Drop it. Drop them down, put them on. Yeah. Jam it up in the space bit. Don't they look purdy, don't they? Oh, they don't look much better than that. Frankie. And then our little guy over here. Porsche Continental Orange, Frankie. Oh, yeah. Stop it, stop it. You're exactly right there. Well, should we go for a test drive and see if we can rattle our teeth? We should. Okay, let's go. Well, Max Verstappen, you're... Uh, you're doing laps in Mexico, and now you're doing laps here in a Clooney garage. Yeah, we definitely learned how not to do it. All right. And we, we should have just dropped that bottom thing in the first yeah. place and done them both at the same time. That's all right, Put Frankie. Have a look. And it's got some mad vibrations now, doesn't it? It's um, it's different. If you're a bit of a princess, you're not going to like it. No. But it's quite an engaging, certainly a low rev as you get that Tingling. vibration through it. Yeah. I like it. But, oh, very yeah, good. If you want your comfort and... Uh, you see the rock and rolling and yeah. inhaling pump and you probably won't like it. Well, I think ZZ Top's more in your category there, Frankie. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> All right, Frankie. Well, we've got our next track day coming up 18th of November, I understand. Yep. Right? We've got some people to beat. Yep. And this is just the car to do it. All right. On that note, don't do it for Dale, do it for Yoda. Catch you later. <laughs>